like a hell cut. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, homies, welcome back. Yeah, so today we are going to check out our boy Hyperion Marvel Superman. Boy, oh boy, <laughs> the Clark Kent, or rather, <laughs> of Marvel. So, but he isn't really the Superman in this particular game. He looks absolutely hideous in this shell sided uniform. Yeah, so anyways, let's go ahead and check out his belt and stats. So as you can see, his energy attack is only 26,644. His attack speed, ignore defense and skill cooldown are all maxed out. We still need to work upon his critical rate and critical defense. And in terms of his gears, there is a lot that we can do because he doesn't have a single piece of Odin's blessings or Uru's. And in fact, all his gears are just at 20 even though he is at level 70 right and yeah all his skills are maxed out right so basically he has and let me tell you as a character initially when he was introduced he was really really bad so met marvel or rather marvel future fire literally had a vote upon the character regarding the character which deserved the most rework and hyperion came out to be on top and he did receive a rework but let's be honest it's not good enough right even though on all his skills there are lots of text involved but yeah <laughs> on paper he's definitely definitely good but practically he is a nuisance right and basically he has a uh, three uh, two hills right one on his third skill which is a massive 20 percent heal and then yeah i believe the second heal is on his passive or something yeah so on his tier one passive of eight percent of max hp recovery for one second with a cooldown of 15 second right okay and his stat enhancement is maxed out wow fantastic <laughs> and he's rocking a stage seven hawkseye he's a uh, yeah he's Custom gear is a max HP, 140% immune to guard break uh, damage proc, right? And he is rocking his classic uniform, which is actually at uh, normal because yeah, there is no point of leveling it up, right? So in terms of his skill, right, there are a lot of flaws. Like you can see, check out his fifth skill. It has a Sharon Rogers level accumulation, right? Like yeah, 15 percent sin of um, basic damage increase and accumulation based on the damage you take apart from that this particular skill has a lot of buff right starting from all attack of increase of up to 25 percent ignore defense which is absolutely ridiculous he does have an invincibility of four second and he has an ignore target dodge rate up to 40 percent which could be really really good for null but the amount of time that you need to press and hold this particular skill by the time he gets all his buffs right his invincibility is all right uh, nah. and his third skill like it is good it has 20 percent of uh, hp recovery but uh, toward the end of the skill when he lands right he is really really vulnerable right like just check out how long it takes him to get all the buffs right and especially the ignore dodge it comes to an end and here comes ignore dodge right <laughs> this is absolutely ridiculous so if we just count right one two three four five so it takes five seconds for him to get all the buffs and the last buff is the ignore dodge buff and do keep it in mind the invincibility lasts only for four seconds and it takes him five seconds to get all the buffs so yeah <laughs> That's not gonna work, dude. That's not gonna work. And look at his third skill, right? Like, yeah. Now there are two flaws with the third skill, as you can see. But once it comes down, right? He is really, really vulnerable, as you can see. The skill is an iframe. Uh, looks when he comes down. He can take one hit from the wall boss legend or even ultimate, and he will die, boys, right? So you cannot you really need to cancel the skill and even if you play out the entire skill right there is a point like you can see the skill can be divided into three parts like the first and the third phase of the skill actually does damage the but however in the middle phase 
he doesn't really do anything surprising so as you can see damage 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 now everything stops and then again damage 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 and especially that's the part when he gets so he himself does get damage right and the only good thing is that while in this even in this mode this is a movable skill and he can even collect the healing blocks from venom right so that's the only good part right but i'd suggest once you're done with this part cancel it into some other skill otherwise you are going to get bamboozled right all right so we are going to try him against skull obsidian we are simply going to do a two minute damage check or just a phase one damage check whichever <laughs> comes first right and we are going to give him all the strikers including uh, venom for heal even though he has two heals one in his passive and one on his third skill right but still he is vulnerable and you will see it in the upcoming video right so that being said boys and girls without wasting much of your time so let's go ahead and check out our boy superman of marvel aka hyperion Here we go! Right, boys so welcome back once again right so as you saw just like Logan even Hyperion lacks a lot in terms of damage and even though he has so many freaking buffs right he's even vulnerable right means he has no defense or no offense even with strikers right it's <laughs> so many strikers however to his uh, defense right he is just a uh, level 70 tier 2 character without his gears at 25 unlike logan and he is not even tier 3 right so i'd say compared to logan his damage is still like um, if he scaled the damage if logan's damage is 19 his damage is 20 right but both of them are really really worse right so if 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 the net marvel wants this character to really do good they then require major 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 changes in their kit guys they require major changes in terms of defense and as well as in terms of offense even though he has accumulation but it's not good enough at this point of time 
So his fifth skill needs to be changed and even his third skill, right? Even if <laughs> that's being said, hopefully the Phoenix Force uniform will do uniform, uh, will do wonders for both Hyperion and hopefully for Logan as well. So that is being said, boys and girls, hope to see you guys in yet another video. And if you did like the video, please leave a thumbs up, right? And in case if you didn't like the video, click on the thumbs up button twice, right? <laughs> and make sure you do subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below so until next time boys and girls adios